Hello everyone. Welcome to Redline Diecast Calls. Today's installment is going to be a preview of the Hot Wheel Redlines that I'll be auctioning on February 8th at Studio Dash Redline, the Facebook site Studio Dash Redline. Check it out. Come by at 6 o'clock Central Standard Time. We're going to be running these beautiful red lines. And this particular auction is going to be, I titled it the Cast of Characters. Right? Cast of Characters or Castings of Characters, like the strip teaser with a kid applied it sticker. Got the parachute still intact. This is tough to find with the parachute still intact there, the plastic piece. You can get them reproduction, but tough to find them in their original state. Nice little strip teaser. Of course, the engine was uh, double use. It was used on the Roger Dodger. You probably know that already, right? Strip teaser. The other cast of characters, something that you've seen and, and loved uh, along the way as a 1956 Ford that was transitioned into. Yep. Short order. Short order in light green. It's a beaut. Look at that Spectre Flame. A couple of kid applied water slides on there. Yep, it's a cast of character for sure. <laughs> oh, you know what I gotta do with this? I gotta put this thing upside down because the uh, transmission really bubbles out on that thing. I'll give you a preview of all the cars after I have these up and, and running. That green color, isn't that come something? So look at the, 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 as an example, the green color of the cord, plastic cord, and the shorter, both light green. Interesting, huh? So this uh, classic cord, in uh, light green, does have an original top. There are the numbers. You know it's real. Tops can run you 75 bucks. Original tops. Classic cord. What a beautiful car. Don't you love that Spectre Flame? Something else. <laughs> Here's another one. Came in the collection. I'm like, what? Custom fleet side in blue. Nice grill. Nice shoes. US. Shiny base. It's got some tail light paint. Kid applied STP sticker. Late run. Got the ribs on the inside of it. I almost think that was maybe a beginning of the Sky Show era, the way that paint is in the back there. What do you think? A little bit of age spots there, some toning going on. Nice fleet sign. Blue custom fleet sign. That's an original, um, original uh, 16. And then right after that, right after that era, came along the 1969 models, and that would be your Vicky as an example. Nice little Vic in orange. Kid applied number six on the side, and the stripe on the top. Yep, they all have a little character to them. I always like to call them time capsules, because they are. <laughs> I just love this history. You're, you know, taking a trip down memory lane, and remembering how you doctored up your cars, and imagined uh you know who's gonna out conduct um custom their red line as opposed to their buddies or their girlfriends right <laughs> like this 312 this sticker a couple of daisies aqua beautiful car hong kong you can tell by the glass a little hong kong in the back there 312p ferrari And then uh, some enamels in this one. It's a um, mongoose. And the thing about the mongoose is that uh, in any of these props, you wanna make sure the prop isn't broken right up on top there. Because it sometimes it'll get caught in the, the holder up there, a little peg, I don't know if you can see that. There it is. 
That little peg there, you get caught sometimes, you get broken. Nice shoes. I just may sell these together, I'm not sure. I don't know what the history is on this particular collection, if they all came, um, if they came together, these, uh, the mongoon and the snake, I'm not sure. Pop is good in that one too. And then just for giggles, I, I thought that I would include a, a nice little snake here that um, came a little bit later, white enamel. This has also got a nice little prop to it. Look like kid applied stickers on there, the water slides. Yep, all unique, all unique stuff, isn't it? Alright, what do we got here? Another one. A little bit of gloss has got a little bit of residue in the back there. Aqua. All to be sold next Tuesday, February 8th, starting at 6 p.m. Central on a Facebook site stall called Studio dash red line. It's a reproduction sticker on the side and a reproduction ramp, but that's an original hot pink custom fleet side. There's that telltale paint I was talking about earlier on the other, the blue fleet side we looked at. Shine. All right, what else do we have here in the tray? Ooh, this is a nice one. Not too bad. Uh, special delivery. Special delivery in light blue. Sort of the tweener blue. This one has all five stickers. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that's what the instructions said when you got the blister of this particular casting. They were, you were instructed to put those stickers like that. Sometimes you don't always find them like that, though. Mm -mm. Sometimes you find them applied, kid applied stickers and all different types of imaginary places. <laughs> Here's kind of a fun one. I, I thought that when I got this collection, I thought, man, look at the way the kid put the stickers on this one. The moon eyes. Cool, huh? Evil Weevil. Red. I'll also have some of that are not any stickers applied. This is a uh, Rolls Royce in green. Silver Shadow. Silver Shadow. Not much of a nick on there either. It's kind of nice on the hood. Silver Shadow. Blinker lights are still intact. Sidekick. This is a nice rose, little rose sidekick action. Of course, the side uh, drivers, uh, or the, the operators, were opened up by the, the exhaust pipes in the back. You actually sort of wiggle that out, and while you're wiggling that out, the um, the sidekick would would pull out. So the pipes are extended now, and that's how the sidekick was uh, designed. Yeah, they made this aftermarket or after the Spectre Flame era. Sometimes you'll see them in blue. Ba, 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 ba. Sidekick in beautiful Spectre Flame Rose. Ooh. Herfies, Warpath. Of course, we uh, ran a Herfies last week. Um, it was a uh, cheap special. This is a warpath, but what the Herfies uh, Burger Chain did on the West Coast there during the, back in the day, 
they would allow, and they made a deal with Mattel to uh, inscribe their company logo, and they sold these in baggies. Beautiful little rig right there. It's a nice car. Nice little piece of history. What else we got here? A couple more. Oh, I'll, I'll do this one here. We'll, we'll just run this one real quick, and I'll do a um, part two. This is a, a rose, also rose. Look at the rose difference. 72 versus 69 or 68. Rose. Funny how things change, huh? Kid put a sticker on there. Custom Corvette, shiny base. Come on, open up there. Ooh, shiny engine on that baby. Nice one. Anyway, um, I'm going to do part two after this one. I'll show you what we got here. This is going to be part of the lineup for this coming Tuesday, February 8th, starting at 6 p.m. Central on Studio Dash Redline. If you care to stop by, I hope you do. Uh, you can, uh, if you're not a member of Studio Redline, give me a holler uh, and I will get you in. If you're on Facebook and you want to send me a private message, I'll get you into the family. We have a blast every single Tuesday starting at 6 p.m. Central. Until then, um, if you like the content, you want to continue to see Red Lines and all their glory, give the uh, video a thumbs up, please. Subscribe and like to the channel, and I'll do my part to do what I'm doing here. By the way, I have an Instagram account as well. Instagram, Red Line Diecast Calls. Check me out. Yeah. Show me what you got. I'm always looking for collections to buy. I'm, uh, I look around the globe for Red Lines. If you got some for sale, hit me up. Okay, everybody. See ya. Bye-bye.